You're early. Yeah, uh, my boss let me off since I finished all my work. Is, uh, is Kylie ready? Where's my child support, Brian? Yeah. Here's a hundred. Well, it's almost. It's ninety-eight dollars. But I do get paid on Friday, and I'll give you the two hundred fifty left when I pick up Kylie for the weekend. Um, does that work? You're supposed to have it today, and once again, you don't. I'm sorry. It's only three more days. No payment, no play date. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Come on, Trish. You know I promised to take her to the comic book shop tonight. Plus, I gave you my last hundred dollars. I'm trying here. Ninety-eight. Clearly not hard enough. I guess you'll just have to wait till Friday. You can't be. Who's at the door? Is Dad here? Oh, um. No, I'm sorry, honey. That wasn't him. Oh, do you know when he is coming? I mean, you know your father. He might not even make it. But I wanted to go to the comic book store. I'm sorry, honey. I'll take you next week. Yeah. Okay. All right, sweetie, before we go to my place, let me give you a gift, okay? But my birthday's not until Sunday. You can just give it to me at my party. Oh, uh, I'm about that. He's not invited, honey. If he wants to throw a party for you, he can. But this is the party I'm throwing for you. Oh, I'm not having one at your house too, Dad? Not a party, no. But because I wanted to do something else fun instead. Can we go to Universal Studios, please? I was thinking maybe we can hit the beach or go to the park. Cheapskate. The beach sounds fun. I don't want her coming home all sandy. Make sure she takes a shower, has clean clothes on, and is at my house before two. Two p.m. works for me. Got it. Uh, let's open your gift. <laughs> is this a vintage Wonder Woman comic book? Yeah. I know how much you love Wonder Woman, and I figure I'll help you build up your collection. I love it, thanks. Um, Kylie, why don't you go wash your hands before we go? Uh, but I want to read my comic book. Come on, Kylie. Thank you. This looks expensive. Yeah, I know, I put in a lot of overtime. Okay, so then where's the rest of my money? No, oh, got it right here. I didn't order anything. Your daughter did. Our daughter. And you ordered something too. Now I'm short $40, but when I pick up Kylie on Sunday, I'll have the rest. Sunday's too late, Brian. I told you I needed it by today, in full. If we didn't have any food, I, I would have, I would have had it all. So you just expect your daughter to starve? No. Of course I'm going to feed her. I have food at home. What kind of father do you think I am? I mean, obviously not a good one. And you're a terrible ex-husband. You know what, actually, Forget about Kylie going with you. She's coming home with me. No, no, it's it's my weekend with her, and, and we plan to go to the beach. Kylie, grab her comic. Let's go, please. What, well, Brian? I was going with Dad. I'm really sorry, baby, but we gotta go. Please, just please don't do this. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Will you need change? Yeah, yeah, I do. I'm really sorry, baby. I'll make it up to you. It's just sometimes adult. Trish! Things. Trish. No. Please, come on. Don't do this to me, and don't do this to her. Don't try to blame this on me, Brian. You do this to yourself. Over a measly $40? Here, you can take this with you, too. I'm not going to let you take her away from me. What are you going to do? Call the cops? Go ahead. I'll just tell the courts that you missed another child support payment. One more missed payment, you go to jail. I'm... I'm trying my best right now. That can't be true. Oh my gosh, look. You know, I don't make much, but I'm doing overtime. 
and I'm giving you every dime that I have, all the while trying to keep things afloat. And my phone is off, okay? And I barely pay my rent just to get you the money. Well, I guess you're gonna have to choose between your rent and your child. Are you serious right now? Mm -hmm. If I don't pay my rent, you have nowhere else to sleep. That's exactly why I want full custody. You're not making any sense right now, Trish. If you want to hurt me, that's fine. But the only person you hurt right now is our daughter. Well, I guess we'll just have to figure that out in court. Don't follow me. I got you one more gift. Universal Studio tickets. Thanks. Well, aren't you excited? You've been talking about going for months. Yeah, I am. Thanks. I think it's time for cake, you guys. Why don't you get in line? Yeah, okay. okay. All right, cool. <laughs> hey, I'll be right back. Okay. Looks like someone's got the birthday blues. Yeah. Thanks to her father, if you want to call him that. Brian didn't want to come? Oh, no. He would have loved to be here. But he never pays his child support, and I just I can't anymore. I wish Brian was more like your ex-husband, Jason. If you weren't my best friend, I'd have no idea you guys were divorced. You think Jason pays child support on time? What are you talking about? I'm barely lucky to get anything at all. Are you serious? Yeah. Why do you let him spend so much time with Carla? It's not about me. You see... When Jason and I first broke up, he only paid child support in full for the first few months. But then eventually, the payments either started coming in short or not at all. I wasn't happy. So I thought stopping Jason from seeing Carla would be a good way to punish him. But then I realized the only person I was punishing was our daughter. Once I realized that, I started letting Carla see her dad again. It's hard at times, but it's worth it to see that smile on my daughter's face. So you see, that's why I still let Jason come around all the time. Because separation with kids involved is not about me. It's about we. Thanks, Shannon. Yeah. <laughs> Could you give me a sec? Oh my gosh, of course. Thank you. You dialed is not in service. Oh, hey, look. I know I still owe you the forty dollars, but I'm gonna give it to you as soon as I can. That's not why I'm here. Oh. Okay. I need to apologize. I've been awful to you. You've been really trying and... I need to be more grateful instead of punishing you by keeping you away from Kylie. I don't know where this is coming from, but thank you. 
And I know it can be frustrating dealing with me and, and my struggles, but I promise you I'll try to be better. You're doing great. Thanks. Uh, so, how's Kylie's party going? Um, it's going, but it's just missing one thing. What's that? Her father. I was wondering if you could get out of here. Would you come? We haven't got the cake yet, and I know Kylie needs you there. Really? Uh, absolutely. Um, just let me just get the bags and. Here, let me help you. Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Kylie. Happy birthday to you. Woo! <laughs> Did you make a wish? Yes, and it already came true. Oh. So what changed? Well, a very wise friend of mine made me realize it's not about me. It's about we. Hey, look what I got. Another Universal Studios ticket? Mm-hmm. I was thinking maybe it would be fun if your dad came. What do you think? Yes! <laughs> this is the best birthday ever! <laughs>